If you're wanting to add some data to your map, what you will do is say, well, how do we do this? You can do it either by going to this positive thing, and this opens up uh, all these folders, and you can go in there and choose the folder that you want. It has the data that you want. Or you can go in there through Add Data, and they'll add, have you go through the same process. See, it kind of remembers where you were. Or you can go to the catalog, and then this kind of wants you to make folder connections. So um, it, it looks where you were before. Or when you first start off, you probably want to just go up here, connect to a folder, and then it'll open a little uh, dialog for you. I'll go into my uh, folders, go into C, and I think I was in ArcGIS, and then in Esri Data, and then in Pennsylvania, and then in German Geographic. So that tells you what folder to go to. You don't want to drill down too far. So now you can open that up and see it. The other way that uh, you can do it. There's another program that came with your your complimentary copy or your copy. It's called Arc Catalog. And if you're working on an agency computer and it doesn't have it up there, you can just um, search for it. And the same thing, it's looking for folder connections so it doesn't have what you want right off the bat. So I'm going to go up here and make a folder connection go into my PC, go to C, and then uh, ArcGIS, S3 Data, this is not big enough, is it? And go to Pennsylvania, German Geographic. Okay, so that should come up. Uh, okay, here it is, right there. It, it goes into your list of connected folders, so you can uh, do that. And then uh, you can preview this is a nice thing, and I'll put that up there. And what it should do is show it to you over there. It will also give you a description of what it is. And then you could look at the lines, preview those. So that's another way you can do it. And if you have them both open at the same time, you can just pull them over like that. And the order, something I have to mention, is the order you put them in. If you see, this is the uh, listing order. This is another way of seeing them, which is uh, a little bit less flexible. With this one, you can move them around. Of course, that doesn't make any sense because now they're covered. Or you can move it there. When you go into this, you can't. But the, the thing that this is helpful for, to me anyhow, is that if you put it on there, you can figure out where your data is coming from. And that can be important to you. So uh, keep that in mind. So this is just how to f um, load data into your onto your data view, and then how to, you can move it around, and then uh, how to find out where it is.